Questions remain about that cybersecurity incident at HSHS Hospitals in Prevea Health. We do have some new information that we'd like to share with you. As of this afternoon, all HSHS phone systems are back up and running in the hospitals, including the six here in the state. But delays and connectivity issues are still possible. As we wait for officials to tell us more about this incident, Brittany Schmidt explains what you should do if you encounter a suspicious email, text, or telephone call. In a video message Friday night, six days into HSHS hospitals and Prevea Health system-wide technical outage, officials confirm a cybersecurity incident. We have deployed additional security measures to safeguard our systems, and we have not detected any further unauthorized access in our IT environment. The hospital system says it doesn't know the scope or impact yet. Third-party experts and law enforcement officials are involved in the investigation. I want to stress, though, that there will be information that we won't be able to share publicly, and that is so we can protect the security of our systems and the privacy of the patients and communities we serve. Cybersecurity experts say there are several different types of incidents, from ransomware attacks to data breaches. Without knowing specifics of this issue yet, we asked an expert about his general advice to someone who may be impacted. Certainly they would be notified there is a legal obligation for the entity uh, to notify patients that their protected health information may have been compromised. And certainly they would have to, should monitor their credit bureaus and also look at their monthly uh, benefit statements from their healthcare providers, looking for any uh, charges that they don't recognize that might represent fraud. According to HSHS Hospitals and Purvea Health's website, there have been some reports of people receiving emails, texts, and phone calls claiming to be an HSHS representative seeking pavement. If it looks suspicious, don't respond. Officials want you to save it and send it to them via this email so they can track and investigate the source. According to HSHS Hospitals and Purvea Health, Officials are still trying to determine if patients' sensitive personal information is involved. The U.S. Department of Health and Human Services notes if there is a HIPAA breach involving unsecure protected health information, impacted patients must be notified within 60 days. But again, HSHS hospitals and Purvea Health have not said what type of cybersecurity incident took down their systems. We are continuing to investigate and we will share more information as we are able. In the meantime, phone systems are working, hospitals and emergency departments remain open, and patients can still schedule procedures. Brittany Schmidt, Action 2 News.